And in the midst of all this, there's one state that's standing out. One state with a surplus of oxygen amidst a mounting COVID crisis. And no points for guessing, that state is Kerala. Kerala has actually increased its oxygen availability by 58% over the last one year. So how is India's only oxygen surplus state managing the crisis and why can't their model be followed by other states? Snehameni Koshi reports. Oxygen refilling units such as this one in Kerala is one of the reasons the state, despite a high number of cases, is an oxygen surplus state, unlike many states, especially in the north. Since the start of the pandemic, Kerala almost doubled the air separation units, revamping six of them and today all 11 are running at full capacity according to the Deputy Chief Controller of Explosives, Dr. Venugopal. Now at present we are able to supply everything and now in this week Kerala may be uh, under the coordination of PESO everywhere they are reaching. So each day as we see the numbers going on, our heartbeat is also going on because we are expecting calls and we are, uh, it, is, uh, it is sad for us to tell that no we cannot supply. The Inox oxygen facility, which is the biggest in the state, used to provide almost 40% of its 149 metric tons capacity to industries say till 2020. And now it is fully delivering only to hospitals. Here at Tiruvannandapura Medical College, the storage capacity has almost been doubled from 20 kiloliters of liquid medical oxygen to 40 kiloliters of liquid medical oxygen. So what's the Kerala model? After the first COVID wave, the state focused on augmenting capacity, rationalizing use, preparing for the crisis that a second wave could bring. Key government hospitals had additional storage capacities installed. While the state increased its oxygen availability by 58% within one year. Uh, even before October, when we reached the peak, we had this issue. We, we knew that our oxygen capacity would be low. So what we did was that uh, the government uh, spent a lot of uh, investment on oxygen uh, plants. You know, the majority of the ICU beds are actually in uh, medical colleges. If you take 10 medical colleges, all the 10 medical colleges are now having at least two liquid oxygen plants like this. Oxygen production in Kerala at nearly 220 metric tons is more than double the state's own demand. So it has been able to send oxygen to Tamil Nadu, Karnataka and even Goa through the various non-government suppliers. Nerevila Sahajiratil Namukavishamaya Oxygen de Alabu Yedivati Nari the Shamsham Dandu Anji Metric Tan Anangiru Yidunuti Patanbade the Shamsham Dandu Rendu Metric Tan Kerala Til Wilpadi Pikanand. Andhra Pradesh is the other southern state that is now delivering much needed oxygen to Maharashtra from the steel plant at Vizag on the new Oxygen Express train. With Uma Sudhir in Hyderabad, Sneha Koshi in Tiruvannandapuram for NDTV.